Welcome guys, and today I'm going to show you the best strat, well not the best, it's one of the best strat to win 1v1s nearly every single time. So all you want to have is a soldier and a farm, nothing else really, um, that's fine, because you'll see why when we get into it. So we're just going to load into a 1v1, um, and I'll see you then. Okay, guys, we are now into the waiting lobby for the maps. And here, personally, for this method, Western is the best, but we don't have it here. But if you don't have Western, try, like, a middle-length uh, map. Not too long. A long one wouldn't work, and a short one wouldn't work. So, just in the middle. But first, what you want to do before the battle begins is place a farm and fertilise it. Upgrade it once, so you get that extra £100 um, into your bank. Well, not bank, like, money. You just want to wait a bit. It's fine if you take some damage, um, because they will take even more in wave 9. Or wave 10, no, 9. Yeah, on wave 9, they will take a lot of damage. So, you see, you need to upgrade this until plantation. Uh, so, we're going to wait for that until next wave. Um, and that's what we're going to do. So, see you in wave 3. I'm now in wave 3, and we have enough to upgrade it to plantation. So, we've just gone ahead and done that. So now we get 200 every time. It doesn't matter if we take a bit of damage. But what you're going to want to do now is get your soldier and place it, three of them, around the map. And do not, just don't upgrade them anything. Just wait, just place them around the map. Um, preferably Western's best because you can put them all on one and they cover a load of space. But... Uh, yeah, but as you can see, we're going to take quite a bit of damage, but it won't matter because we will then destroy them in wave 9. So, yes. Now we're going to go ahead and place another soldier with our farm, collecting 200. Uh, we're going to place it just here. And we're not going to upgrade any of them except one. So you need to choose one that's like in the best spot, really. Uh, to upgrade to level four or no level three actually yeah level four so yes yeah, oh, sorry you want to make it to severe training just on one of them and then just save up as much money as you can until wave nine and you'll see why then because we're going to send a bit and it's going to be too much for them to handle and they're gonna it's gonna get past so our soldier is gonna take care of these these um zombies so see you in wave nine when i've upgraded this guy and we're ready for the next thing or i can upgrade it now so see you in wave nine Okay, guys, we are now in wave nine. We've got our soldier to level four. And now all we're going to do is send boss ones. You can only do this in wave nine. So it's 250 pounds. But whenever, just spam them. You can see them over there. Absolute grind them. Because it'll be too much for them. 180 with all the others. And it'll get past. And they're already on 12 HP. But that boss is dead because it still has two soldiers to get past to. Um, now we can spam a bit more. And then our farm's going to let us do a bit more. Yep. So we just add another. Oh, wait. Yeah, we're going to add some more. Yeah. But also, if you're just a bit worried... Um, about bosses getting past you can upgrade your soldiers a bit but it's not that necessary uh, as that was only six hp as you can see and there are so many bosses over there and it's going to come to the win here 
because they just can't handle. Sending is the most OP thing in 1v1s. And see, uh, I've upgraded my soldier a bit here, just in case these slows get past. We're only on 44. Just do a bit, because we have enough. See, there's the victory already. Probably one of the bosses got in, or something else, maybe a slow. But this is the best strat, and hopefully you enjoyed it. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to subscribe.